the pandemic itself forced everyone to uh, uh, follow the SOP, social distancing, you know, uh, testing and uh, tracing. So for Gamuda, uh, that safety level has even gone up. We even have our uh, PCR lab, yeah, that help uh, both uh, all, all the people in the group, including Gamuda Land. And uh, that itself uh, is most important to make people feel safe, even to work and for customers to uh, come into our project. On all our sites, we have to mitigate the spread of COVID-19 by setting up quarantine facilities for all our site staff and conduct rapid testing to ensure uh, we adhere to the COVID-19 SOPs and to do our part to flatten the curve, which is still progressing on business continuity. We immediately set up a COVID committee to look into means how to ensure our workers, our workforce not affected, be able to continue the work throughout the pandemic. Well, despite the pandemic, um, Gamudan has done very well, uh, thanks to my colleagues and friends in uh, Gamudan land. Good. And this is possible uh, uh, because they have responded to the pandemic differently. The e-commerce itself allowed them to uh, do a lot more deals, engagement with the customers, uh, uh, and especially bookings and uh, sales and uh, payment. And last but not least, they also uh, roll out uh, the Gamuda Land Experiential Gallery, Virtual Gallery uh, in July, which helped the customers to navigate um, in, uh, and uh, look at our products that we have virtually, 3D uh, virtual walkthrough that allowed them to see the products even though uh, there's a movement control. For Mega Rail Project in Malaysia, we only have uh, MRT3 to look at. So the way forward is that we are looking at overseas projects to ensure that we, we be able to secure a mega project. The, the country that we look at is like Australia and Taiwan. And in Australia, we have uh, we have four real projects that we are uh, we are intend to to tender. Two uh, in the tendering process, and the other two is upcoming. The four project in Australia is uh, Sydney Metro West, Sydney Metro West, Sydney Metro Western Sydney Airport. And uh, two more in Melbourne, which is a sub-urban rail loop and a, a Melbourne Airport Rail Link. These are the four projects that we are looking at and we hope to secure one at least from the four projects. Well, the market outlook, I see that it's going to be uh, great. People are looking forward for us to uh, uh, launch newer products uh, similar to Ilaria in Gamudan Gardens. So, and 25-7, uh, the project near Kutukuf Muning itself will bring in more sales because uh, people have been waiting for this uh, mall in this area and they would like to see that the mall is successful. Uh, that's the only mall in the, this, this area, uh, Kutukuf Muning. Uh, so, uh, we expect the sales to pick up. Uh. As far as overseas project, Vietnam has always been doing well. It's the uh, fastest growing economy in the Southeast Asia. And for Singapore project, uh, we'll see that it will pick up uh, after the uh, pandemic. Uh, Singapore has always been a vibrant economy. Yeah. Uh, with the stimulus package by the government, uh, I see that uh, they will pick up very soon. And our project in Ola definitely is a uh, 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 property to buy yeah, in, in Singapore.